Good news in the effort to keep children safe from COVID-19. Pfizer just announced a lower dose of its coronavirus vaccine does appear to be safe for children ages 5 to 11. Dr. Max Gomez tells us there could be shots in kids' arms in just a matter of weeks. As children go back to school across the country, there's a growing anxiety among parents and teachers as to whether their elementary age children are safeguarded against the coronavirus without an approved vaccine. The concern is warranted. Children now account for more than one in five new cases of COVID. And the highly contagious Delta variant has sent more children into hospitals and intensive care units in the past few weeks than at any other time in the pandemic. Most of those sick kids are unvaccinated. Pfizer's announcement of results from its clinical trial of more than 2,200 children ages 5 to 11 showed that this group developed a strong antibody response. It's effectively the same vaccine that's being used in adults, but in a, in a lower dose. Pfizer tested multiple doses to find the, the optimal dose that had the best compromise between reducing the number of vaccine-related side effects while still providing efficacy that's on par with what we saw in 16 to 25-year-olds. So this is basically one-third the, the dose that's, gonna, that's already approved in adults. Former FDA Commissioner Dr. Scott Gottlieb says that even though children rarely become severely ill if they're unvaccinated, they can spread the virus to family members, teachers, and grandparents who are vulnerable to severe disease or death. Pfizer will apply for an emergency use authorization within a couple of weeks for a dose that's a third of the adult dose, what researchers call the sweet spot, a strong antibody response, but low enough to minimize adverse reactions. Pfizer will likely get that authorization by Halloween or early November. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News. And Dr. Max tells us trial results for kids under the age of five won't be available until the end of the year.